Hi everyone! Today we talk about Teams for Wildex, the new integration of the Wildex phone system with Microsoft Teams, and the only one that doesn't require additional Microsoft 365, Office 365 licenses. Wildex has developed a plugin allowing you to connect to Wildex PBX and Microsoft Teams. As a result, a Teams user can not only place and receive calls, but also benefit from all the advanced telephony features offered by Wildex, such as queue calls, voicemails, IVRs, day and night service, etc. The call routing rules are entirely set up on the Wildex site in WMS dial plans. To use this integration, Class Sound service must be activated on the PBX and users must have essential business or premium licenses. The integration is supported both in the native app and in the browser version of Microsoft Teams. The plugin must be added on the admin account of the company and then it becomes available for the users of the company's domain in the MS Teams. Once the plugin is added, we can see the new Wildex tab in the MS Teams interface. We specify our PBX domain and now we can use Microsoft Single Sign-On to access collaboration inside MS Teams. Make sure you enable the option Call Control Only when you sign in. Please note that this option must be first activated on the PBX. The minimum supported WMS release is 5.03. This version adds the possibility to use the second collaboration tab in Control Mode to make calls. This means I can have two collaborations open, one in Teams and another one in the browser or as a native app with the same account. And control the web phone of another collaboration from Teams. So please make sure you keep another collaboration open either in the browser or the native app. In collaboration inside Teams, I select which Wildex device I would like to use to make and receive calls. Let's select the web phone, the Wildex is embedded WebRTC soft phone. I can now place calls from Teams both internally and externally, thanks to Class Sound, the Wildex is embedded SIP trunk. Please pay attention, I don't use the Teams dialpad, I use collaboration inside Teams. And we can receive calls to Teams too. I can also select another device here, for example, Vision, which is uh, the Wildex desk phone, and control it from Teams. I can transfer a call or put it on hold. I can control any other Wildex device assigned to my account, such as a decked handset or headset or the smartphone app. In case you need to place calls from the Teams dialpad for some reason, it is also possible. This way of using Teams for Wildex integration is called Microsoft Phone System. It is more complicated to set up and it is more expensive. Let's see together how to set up Microsoft Phone System mode. The first step is to request the service on WMP, the Wildex management portal. MS Phone System requires a monthly fee uh, per system, which is applied once you purchase the service on WMP. Then you'll have to wait till your system is added on the dedicated micro Microsoft portal. Once it is added, we send you the invitation and then the end customer, the admin of the Microsoft domain, will have to access this dedicated portal and add or import users. All users who will be added on this dedicated Microsoft portal need a Microsoft 365 E5 plan or a Microsoft Phone System License plus Microsoft 365 E3 plan. In addition to that, those users need to have at least an essential license on the Wildex site and Class Sound service must be activated on the PBX. The hybrid model is also possible where you purchase Microsoft licenses only for certain users, those who um, don't need to use the Teams dialpad can continue to use the first mode that we talked about in the first part of this video. And place and receive calls from the collaboration tab and not from the calls tab of Microsoft Teams. 
I already made the configuration on the dedicated portal and made sure that my user has all the licenses. I have the Teams for Wildex plugin and I have added my PBX domain and logged into Collaboration. It's not a must to log into Collaboration from Teams, but if you do, you can benefit from all the features discussed in the first part of this video, for example, control other devices, uh, send faxes, set up call forwarding rules from Collaboration inside Teams. Let's open the Calls tab and dial either an internal or an external for number uh, to place a call. I'm dialing another PBX user now and I can manage the call from MS Teams dialpad. DTMFs are also supported. In case of an incoming call, I can see a pop-up from MS Teams and again I can answer it and manage the call directly from Teams. That's all for today. As you can see, our Teams for Wildex integration is quite flexible. It doesn't require expensive Microsoft licenses. However, if your users need to place calls from the Teams dialpad, it is also possible. And the hybrid mode is possible. Thanks for watching, see you next time, and we're looking forward to your feedback.